And for the first and only time in history, a black man held one of the greatest honors which exists in the field of sports and athletics. Jack Johnson, America's first black heavyweight champion. Some in the crowd now began to shout, stop the fight, stop the fight. Johnson toyed with him for five rounds, knocked him out, then helped carry him to his corner. He wrote about his finely tailored suits, the gold caps he had placed on his front teeth. He flaunted his wealth. Johnson had replaced his front teeth with gold ones. Gold teeth, and he flashed that. Inspired so much hatred of white America that in the 19 years since the end of his reign, no black fighter was given the opportunity to even challenge for the heavyweight crown. In Jeffrey's corner, Jim Corbett spewed a stream of racial insults. Johnson just pounded Jeffrey's and grinned back. Don't let the nigger knock him out. The police stopped the fight to save Burns further humiliation and ordered the movie cameras to stop grinding. in his beautiful clothes and smiling with his gold teeth at the camera as if I'm here and you're not. I have found no better way of avoiding race prejudice than to act with people of other races as if prejudice did not exist. Jack Johnson.